The twin headed dragon. No, that is not a stupid joke for the name of my penis. Uh -huh. The twin headed dragon is, I feel like it's a football term that I've heard before when teams use really successful two back sets. Meaning they always have two running backs in the backfield just to confuse the opponent and they have no idea which running back it's going to. So the only difference between this and a normal game plan is I am putting all of my hopes in the fact that I can beat my opponent with solely my running backs. Holy I will not be passing shit. to anyone. I have sung my wide receivers out for tight ends so that they can block them. As you might imagine, I'm gonna run a ton of RPO peak zone bubble. Perfect. So I got Gronk, Darren Fells, and Evan Engram blocking. They're not by any means the best blocking tight ends you get in the game, but they're gonna be enough to just bully some corner. I got Barry Sanders at my starting halfback and then Bo Jackson backup. So I'm just using my halfbacks pretty much. Everybody always asks what playbook I run to do RPO peak zone bubble. RPO peak zone bubble is in Tennessee Titans offense and pass balance, and that's it. I'm gonna go into weekend league too, by the way. I'm going into weekend league. So I'm gonna be playing against kids who are actually pretty damn good at this game, hopefully. Without further ado, let's do it. All right, the twin headed dragon. Okay, so obviously peak zone bubble works very well for this play. But there's a lot of other plays you can run too. Really, all you have to do is go to personnel and look for anything with two running backs. For example, I can run fullback dive. This will go to Le'Veon Bell. But then, after I get them thinking I'm only gonna run fullback dive, I run fullback dive, halfback flip. Now, I do have fourth and two right here, so I'm just gonna run one more halfback dive and get it. Can we get two yards on a halfback dive? Fourth and two, there's a blitz, good blocks, but... Oh my god, I think I got that. Oh, I didn't get it? Damn. It doesn't matter. I'll showcase it more when I get the ball back, which I will do very quickly here. Underneath, covered. Well, not really, actually. Damn, it got kind of open. Second and four. We got a run play. Oh, he flipped it to the right side, but I got him with Shaz. Thank God. That's a touchdown if I didn't. He's going to do all this work and not score. It's so pointless. All right, first and ten. There's the underneath. I've got a couple rolling this way. Uh-oh, dumb. Dumb, I told you, why were you gonna pretend like you were gonna score, man? Let me get back to this twin-headed dragon. I was kind of out of the loop on the first try, all right? So the goal is just to confuse your opponent, make them never know which halfback it's gonna go to, and then eventually you give it to one and completely throw them off the scent. So right now, I'm gonna look like I'm gonna run that fullback dive one more time. But I'm gonna do the fake halfback flip. It's gonna go to Bo Jackson. We'll see what happens here. All right. Okay, wait, there's actually a ton of people over there, but Bo Jackson cuts it up the middle. Admittedly though, RPO Peak Zone Bubble will always be the best. If he doesn't go on Barry, we're just gonna take this all the way. Third and four. He's not on it. He's not on it. All right, now we're just gonna go all the way with it. Oh boy, that's a touchdown. It's really the best play in the game. The amount of times I've scored doing just that right there is stupid. And then once he wants to get cute and go on Barry Sanders every time, I'm just gonna keep giving it to Bo Jackson because those are my two X factors. Also, this is so much better because I have Evan Engram, Gronkowski, and Darren Waller blocking as opposed to like Tyree Kill and Torrey Holt. This dude's gonna get really frustrated when he can't gain a single yard. Okay, I'm gonna run this backwards. So I, oh, damn it, Barry Sanders, go away. I was gonna say I wanna run. Oh, yeah, he's rage quitting. All right, well, twin headed dragon. One rage quit in six minutes. Also, huge shout out to Raycon for continuing to sponsor my videos. As you may or may not know, Raycon is the earbuds that I'm always wearing. They are amazing, and I wanna tell you about them. So if you're not looped in, Raycon makes premium wireless earbuds. Super comfortable, they sound amazing, they have cool colorways. But the best part is they're about half the cost of any other premium wireless earbuds that you're used to seeing. The one I've been wearing recently, which is their newest model, is the E25. I'll show you it. So this is the charging case, and here's the earbuds. They are pretty. So the E25 is their best one yet. Six hours of playtime, super compact design, as you can see. Increased bass, pairs Bluetooth effortlessly, and they have a ton of really cool colorways, too. So I have a link for you to cop these earbuds. If you use that link in the description box, you're gonna get 15% off your order, so you have to make sure to do that. So again, link in the top of the description. Raycon Thank you for sponsoring as always and enjoy the rest of the video guys. Right side run to Eric Dickerson. Oh boy. Got a feeling we're gonna see a lot of that. Alright, he doesn't run it this time. I really expected to see it. We got a sack. Everything was covered. He could not have thrown to a single route down there. Alright, I'm gonna send Lawrence Taylor and Kalomak on a blitz here. 
All right, boys. Uh, oh my God, he, he did a read option? Why? That was bizarre. Now, one thing I can do out of this too is pass to both, especially if he starts sending a ton of, ooh. It's gonna say if he starts sending a ton of blitzes like that. We have a truly good opponent here. So this is gonna be interesting to see if we can pull it off. He's running cover one contain. I have no idea how good this is against the run. I've never seen this before. Not that good, no way! No way he tackled me, that was a touchdown! Damn, that sucks, but all right. We're gonna peek zone bubble this. We'll see if he gets on Barry. He can't get to Barry, he's on the wrong side of the field. Great downfield block, he got one! Can I get another? Oh my God, wait, he's gonna break that. Damn, and Deion Sanders came across to get the tackle. Peek zone bubble, man. Now he's gonna fly on Barry. We just handed off to Bo Jackson. He's screaming on it. He's so ready to go get it. And then you give it to Bo Jackson. All right, Bo Jackson's back in the backfield. I guess Barry is tired. We're gonna go with that stretch again. It's totally there. All right, I'm gonna send Barry up and I'll send Bo on a playmaker. And we just need Lamar to stay alive in this pocket. I'm gonna throw that. That's a really stupid throw, but I'm gonna throw it. No, he did not catch it! No, he did not! Oh, oh my god! Wait, 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 wait. That was Bo Jackson! Man, I'm dead. Dude, I have never gotten any of my wide receivers to ever moss somebody like that. And Bo Jackson just did it to two people. Oh yeah, he's about to just run stretch. He's pissed. We're seeing one already. Okay, I gotta let him break a tackle. Oh, he's looking right where I'm standing. Oh my God, Patrick Wilson's got to hurdle him. Oh, and he drags me down. There is a halfback cross screen. It looks like peak zone bubble. It is not peak zone bubble. And he completely covered it, which really sucks. All right, we're gonna flip sides on this. Third and 11. I definitely need one more touchdown to secure the epic victory royale here. He's not on the right side. He can't get to it. Oh, he's gotta be on the right side, get a juke! Oh, Barry! Now, yes, I absolutely could take my field goal, but I'm not gonna do it. Let's see where he is. Where is he in relation to Barry? Dude, he's literally nowhere near him. What is this guy doing? I don't want this to be a peak zone bubble video. I wanna hand it off. Dude, play Barry Sanders! Stop it! Stop letting me have free yards! Well. This is another Peak Zone Bubble video. But I will say Peak Zone Bubble is the coolest play in this game, so I hope you like that anyway. Barry's swinging down, and he... Dude, are you like just... Like, do you want me to score? First and goal. Let's see if he goes goal line. I kind of want to just give it to Bo Jackson right up the middle. <laughs> yeah, dude. You have four down linemen. Bo Jackson's going to run your whole squad over for this touchdown. There it is. TD, come here! Oh, my God. <laughs> he missed 14 to 0. All right, I'm gonna try base halfback slip screen. Nothing funny. Can it please get open? I want this to be there. Oh, it is. It is. No! No! It got to be so fast. I'm like really sad about that. I wanted that to work more than anything. It is now third and 20. I'm not giving up on this slip screen yet. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. Damn it! On 4th and 17 from our own 18, we're definitely going for it. I, I think he might just be blitzing. Okay. No! Oh my god, horrible pass. That was terrible. I wanted that just to go to my halfback. 2nd and 4, we're sending a blitz. He throws the pitch. I got Tillman out here. No, I missed him. I don't know why he would try and throw this ball. Are you really gonna get like a goal line pick because you wanna throw this ball so bad? Inside zone, dude, inside zone. Oh my God, he's so dumb. Loser. Maybe he's not so dumb, he scored on me. You know, that is what I get for going for it. I'm gonna give him a couple handoffs to Bo Jackson and then toss it into Barry. All right, there's one to Bo Jackson. Broke a tackle. Broke another one. Jeez. Third and three. One more time, one more handoff, Bo Jackson. Let's see where his user goes. Oh no, he's not on Barry. Dude, why do they do that? <laughs> That's how you get them. Oh, I forgot that I still have to juke another guy out. All right, now it looks like it's Pig Zone Bubble, but it's actually this cross screen. I swear this will work. I just need to not get clamped on it. Okay, no, but there's one dude. I'm there's one dude to block. Oh my God, there's one dude to block, bro. I think he's just gonna blitz every time now, but I can only throw to my halfbacks, you know? I'm throwing it right there. Damn it. 
overthrew it by just a little bit. Now he turned the ball over. All right, this is a pass, I feel like. Touch pass. Touch pass read option, basically. Third and six. This is actually a really big stop if we can pull this off. Let's see where he wants to go. I got the middle covered. Oh, he throws half back. It's wide open. All right, I'm sending the blitz. He's going to run this ball. Oh, it's the counter. It's the counter. We got a ton of dudes on it. Eric Dickerson got lit up. All right, we're back to the pass. I think it might just be the same route. Oh, no, it's different routes. He's throwing cool. Wow, that was a bad pass. Best way to describe it. I will never, ever lose faith in this slip screen. Can I do it? Can I do a slip screen against a goal line defense? I have no idea if this is possible. Um, oh my God! Let's go! It finally worked! <laughs> what a weird play for it to work on, too. First and 10. He's going with a halfback mid draw. Third and 11, has to pass. Play action, corner route. I got this post route, and that's a sack. Joey Bosa, that's the game. We are gonna send our big boys off the edge, and then we're just gonna go clamp like men. Okay, wait a second, oh, he didn't get it. <laughs> what a good play. Okay, I will not be happy unless I get this halfback cross screen to work, dude. My whole life is gonna crumble if I can't get this shit to work. It looks like Pizzo Bubble. So go over there like it's Pixel Bubble, and then you be open, and then block set up. Damn it, Pat Tillman. Ironically, this guy, this guy's not playing the bubble screen, but he is playing the interior run. So it's like I can literally just keep lobbing this to Barry Sanders and get infinite yards, but I can't hand it off to Bo Jackson. All right, boys. Fourth and 16. I think it's time for Bo Jackson to moss somebody. He's on the wrong dude. 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 Can we get there? Can we get there? <laughs> Fourth and 16, RPO Big Zumbo. That's all I have to say. Switch your formation, dude, please. I just want to run the ball, Bo Jackson. Please. Please, bro, stop. You're going to let me score every time, dude. Seriously, stop. Stop. You know what the twin-headed dragon really is? The twin-headed dragon really is putting all of your faith in the entire game on RPO peak zone bubble. Because if you can tell yourself that if I make all the correct reads, no matter what this dude does, he can't stop me if I run RPO peak zone bubble. And I just 28 to seven this guy with only RPO peak zone bubble pretty much. This is weekend league, he's got a good team. I'm telling you guys now, it may not be unstoppable. You might not win every play, but I actually encourage you to try it. It's super fun. All right, and on fourth and 17, he's going for it. I actually could get one more touchdown here. Yep, I'm gonna get one more touchdown. For the final time. Oh yes, ball! <laughs> Go, ball! Bo Jackson had such a bad game, dude. He literally just had a chance to get his touchdown right there and he goofed it. All right, stats. Let's see him. Rushing. Yeah, we didn't really do shit in the rushing game. Barry had two passing touchdowns, 235 yards on 14 receptions. That's it, boys. I hope you enjoyed this. It was an absolute blast to make. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.